The Prespa Lakes are one of Europe's environmental treasures and the surrounding area's wetland habitats are some of the oldest in the world, dating back millions of years. This history provides Prespa with a unique and special mix of European biodiversity that Life Funds have been helping to conserve through a number of projects in and around the Prespa area. Many good practices to biodiversity management have been demonstrated through the Life Funds and in 2014, a Best of the Best Life Project Prize was awarded to the area for its success in using information as an effective nature conservation tool. Well, Prespa is one of the 10 most important wetlands in the Mediterranean, especially for fish. This is because the area has 23 fish species, nine of them are endemic. However, this is not very well known among different uh, stakeholders and actors. The area is more well known for birds. And through this project, we wanted to raise awareness between local stakeholders and national actors for, and international actors for fish protection, but also we wanted to create a common base of understanding between different people for the importance of fish and the implementation of specific conservation measures. This goal of using life information funds to achieve a common understanding and consensus approach among fisheries stakeholders proved to be very useful. The lake's commercial fishing sector was one of the main beneficiary groups from this information activity, who were able to gain a lot of new practical knowledge from the LIFE project. I am a member of the TUTUGIS, I am a member of the TUTUGIS, I am a member of the TUTUGIS, and I think that this program has very important benefits όσον αφορά τους, τους ψαράδες σε εμά, αλλά και όσοι ενδιαφέρονται για, την, για την περιοχή της Πρέσπας. Ε, μας δόθηκε η ευκαιρία να πούμε και τις απόψεις μας και εμείς ε, για κάποιες συμπεριφορέ όπως τα, τα ψάρια, τα πουλιά στην, στις λίμνες. Ενημερωθήκαμε και από επιστήμονες κάποια πράγματα που δεν, εμείς δεν τα γνωρίζαμε. Ήταν πολύ αποδοτικό, πολύ θετικό νομίζω το πρόγραμμα αυτό. Ένα από τα πράγματα που μάθαμε από του επιστήμονε είναι το, το εξή. Τα τελευταία χρόνια, α πούμε, ενώ υπήρχε πάρα πολύ χέλη πριν είχαν οι λίμνε, τα τελευταία χρόνια έχει εξαφανιστεί. Και ανησυχούσαμε, λέγαμε τι, τι συμβαίνει. Πληροφορηθήκαμε από του επιστήμονε ότι πλέον οι λίμνε μα δεν έχουν επικοινωνία με τη θάλασσα, οπότε δεν μπορεί να, δεν μπορεί να έρθει το χέλη. Έπειτα κάποια ψάρια μη ενδυμικά αποδεικνύεται ότι είναι ει βάρο των ενδυμικών. Και όταν ε, γίνεται κάποιο, αν μελλοντικά γίνει κάποιο εμπλουτισμό, θα πρέπει να είναι μπροστά οι επιστήμονε με κάποιε μελέτε, με κα... μεγάλη προσοχή, ώστε να αφήνει η άποψή μου σαν παλιό ψαρά. Using life information funds in this way to help demystify ecological science and explain it in everyday terms that people could relate to was another success factor for the project. We included in all, in all of our material the traditional ecological activities of the area. It was important to link what we are doing, our result of the scientific research, with the activities of people. The project team did this by concentrating on raising awareness about how the fish's environment affects everyone and how changes to the lake environment can affect people's everyday lives, especially in things such as sustaining local food supplies and maintaining jobs for the area. During the process of achieving a consensus and understanding with the different stakeholders about Prespa's fish conservation needs, a range of useful knowledge was gained about the best way to use information tools like television. One of the lessons uh, that we learned during the project was that it is important to understand that uh, these tools as the, as the documentary and the TV spots which reach thousands of people are, are strong uh, means to, in order to spread messages and uh, very, very often they act as catalysts in order to reach a lot of people, but of course you have to have in parallel with them specific activities which will be implemented in different levels from a local level to a national level in order to ensure that your project will have some specific results on the ground. And uh, in order to do this, we put some indicators in order to evaluate their eff effectiveness. Of course, for the usual means, TV spots and documentary, the indicators could, can be how many people will see the documentary, what, how many people will read your newsletter, 
but at the ground we used specific indicators which were related not with the information that was spread but with the result of it. For example, it was important for us to have an institutional improvement in fishing and actually we succeeded in this by including fishermen in the Wetland Management Committee which is a, co it is a committee which decides on uh, various wetland management measures. So you have to, to use not only the ordinary indicators, but also specific indicators which are linked with other uh, sectors as policy, as institutional improvement, as conservation on ground. Ongoing evaluation of the Life Project's information tools was also effective for identifying early on any need to modify the information campaign. You can, you can foresee everything during a life project, but it was good that we had the flexibility to modify, to, to, we had the time to evaluate the impact of uh, our activity and modify accordingly uh, this activity for future, because uh, the activities of the life project uh, didn't uh, end, the project ends, but the activities continue.